In today's real estate market news, we saw pending home sales drop to a record low, even worse than the 2008 real estate market crash. A recent housing report shows that pending sales of previously owned homes in the US fell to its lowest level on record in October, confirming a resale market that's being hammered by buyers having to borrow at significantly higher interest rates and the currently high home prices. Bloomberg reported that the National Associations of Realtors chief economist stated that during October, mortgage rates were at their highest and contract signings for existing home sales were at their lowest in more than 20 years. The NARS index of contract signings to purchase resale homes declined 1.5%, the lowest data dating back to 2001, the NAR reported on Thursday. We currently have mortgage rates near levels not seen since the early 2000s, combined with the still high prices and lack of inventory in certain areas is keeping would-be buyers on the sidelines. Home sales activity has also been restrained by a lack of home sellers due to homeowners who locked in rates at much lower levels like around 3 or 4 percent and are remaining reluctant to list their properties. You can't really blame them though. By region, only the Northeast saw an increase in pending sales last month. Sales fell the most in the West, down 6%, while contract signings in the South and Midwest slipped 1.9% and 0.4% respectively. So you might ask yourself, where are we going from here? Well, only time will tell, but to me, it clearly looks like the cities that skyrocketed in recent years are now being hammered down to a more realistic and sustainable level. For more real estate-related content like this, remember to subscribe and check out my next video.